welcome back <laughs> and joining us for our third conversation yes. this morning. We shifted gears from volleyball to some lovely ice cream. Yes. And of course, who better to talk to us about ice cream than the ladies at the ice cream mm. shop? Ladies, who do we have here with us this morning? Yes. Good My name I'm Abby. And my name is Azaria Chaplin. All Hi. right. Welcome, and welcome. Welcome, ladies. So we all know Ice Cream Shop always have these amazing flavors. Yes. And I'm going to always take it a notch up. And I love on the lobster fist um, flavors, rice and beans <laughs> yeah, flavors. All like, these things that are very, very near and dear to Belizeans. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> what do we have this morning in terms of your new items on the shelf? Uh, this morning, we have our new summer uh, sorbet flavors, a couple of them that we made for you guys to sample today. Ooh. So starting off, we have piña chelada, which is a spicy pineapple sorbet. Ooh, uh -huh. Sorry, one second. <laughs> this is the piña 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 chelada. chelada. It's Look at that. a spicy pineapple sorbet with mm -hmm. coconut rum and Minchelada mix. Ooh. Still on, on so always, that's one of the on spirits. always bring this. Okay, so this is the first one that we are testing out mm. this morning. Yes, mm. so you all also brought us a mixturing, mixing device mm -hmm. here. What is this supposed to do? That's for our sorbet refresher that we're going to blend up for you guys at the end okay. with the coconut latte. Since this morning, is it the morning? It's mm -hmm. coffee. You guys will get a little cake yes, out of it. Yes, I like that. Like that a lot. <laughs> so this is the uh, piña. Chelada, Chelada yes. All then right. They, they brought about five flavors, guys. They did. Mm -hmm. And there's one special. That, <laughs> that, never, at the end. That, at we, the we, end. We, we, are, we are telling you a little bit more about that, right? But there's a special one, too. Um, but I listen, I love their blackberry amaretto. It is... Mm. That's still your favorite. It's Are still you asking my for blackberry amaretto um, over there? Doing I, 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 you know, I have a sweet tooth, you know. I right. love dessert. Well, let's try this piña chelada. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. It tastes like fresh pineapple. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm. Fresh pineapple. I, you know? No one, when it's you freeze a, a pineapple and you try to blend it up for like a smoothie, yeah. mm -hmm. that's exactly what it tastes like. And you said it's have coconut rum, you know? Eh? Yes, yes it tastes that too. <laughs> <laughs> it's delicious. It's very delicious. Uh, yeah. So what are you spring up here for us uh, next? This is tambran chamoy. Ooh, Who don't like chamoy? Um, weird. And they have tambran. So tambran chamoy. Is it because tambran is in season right now? Probably. Well, a lot of customers, well, we think that tamarind and chamoy is a very good combination, obviously. Yeah. Well, what do you think, Zween? Delicious. Yeah? So, let's talk about the items that you add here, because I'm looking at this and you can tell that it has the chamoy mm -hmm. in it. Like, the big, the big chunks of chamoy are definitely in this. So, you're utilizing a lot of um, fruity flavors that are Belizean. So let's talk yeah. about that and why yeah. you do that. Well, we try to keep it local as possible because our customers, they're all very great with the idea of us like using natural flavors and flavors around like crabu and sour stuff. So we try to keep it as local as possible, especially with these flavors that we have around. Mm -hmm. And we try to use and to be... Yeah, that's one of the things that I think oh, is wow. just amazing with you guys. You take the Belizean flavors and then you turn it into ice creams and, and these sorbets. Let's talk about what's the difference between the sorbet and, you know? Ice cream. Ice cream. Great. So for the sorbets, these cater to people that are dairy-free and lactose-free. Mm -hmm. um, so they don't have any cream, they don't have any milk, so they're all water-based, I would say. Oh, okay. Okay, so they, they're completely different from ice cream. But um, compared to our ice cream that has cream and it's creamier, it's milkier, so it's better than, well, I say it's better than the sorbet. I love but a, I love a good sorbet because it's refreshing. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right now it's hot, so you want something mm -hmm. cool to cool you down. And so this one is green apple, guys, and you can tell it's green. But <laughs> I, man, uh, yeah, mm. this is your one. Okay, mm. let's let me try this one. Mm. But green apple is not well, you know. Listen, guys, they brought coffee. From you guys, you know I love mm. coffee. April loves coffee. I love coffee. And I there, they brought this machine with them. 
<laughs> we're going to do a whole mixture thing for him. <laughs> and that's all I want to say. This one is different. This one, this one is different. I really still like, I still, I'm still on that tambran chamoy. Yeah? Mm -hmm. okay. oh, which uh, one? Oh, coconut, latte? Mm -hmm. coconut latte? Coconut yes. latte? Okay, wait, I want to show you. Okay, sorry. The coconut latte, mm. this one right here, that beautiful, you could tell that they have um, coffee in it. Dwayne Dunn, they're like two ice creams ahead of me. Can I try to keep up? All right. Mm. Mm. So this one is a coconut milk and coffee sorbet. You're tasting you the, taste coconut the coconut milk, milk immediately. immediately. Mm. Oh. We just had coconut curry this morning. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a good, a good mm -hmm. mix. Wonderful. Okay, so you said you had a surprise for us in terms of what you're gonna mix. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna uh, make a sorbet refresher mm -hmm. with coconut latte. So it's coffee with more coffee. Oh, okay. ooh! That's what I tell you, we love coffee. Coffee pairs coffee. better with more coffee. You understand me? Mm -hmm. like, yeah. Take it away, Let's do it. Okay. So we make this in the shop, but we have we make them with the pina colada and the tamarind chamoy, depending on what you'd like. And it's okay. great for the heat. It's refreshing, especially nice. with the summer like and outside that. it's hot, and you want something that's not like milky, but you want something refreshing. These are a good option for for you guys. So we make it with the pina colada and the tamarind chamoy. So if you go into the shop and you ask for the yeah. flavors, mm -hmm. we have them, and you guys wow. can always get them. And then and this, this is one. this is like um, drip coffee. Regular, regular, regular dark coffee. coffee. Yeah, regular dark oh, coffee. Beautiful. And so it's gonna be. It's so, not only for adults. Well, you do have those that are spirited, but mm -hmm. it's not only for adults. For kids as well. Yeah. And, and then so you can, it's almost like a like a mangonara, but uh, our style. Yeah. So if you want the tamarind chamoy, it doesn't have any. This one doesn't have any spirits in yeah. it, so it's just gonna be a little bit spicy. And then you guys, if you want more chamoy in it, you can always ask us. We pour on someone top, pour in the cup. <laughs> yes, you understand, right? As Neja is uh, mixing up our lovely um, concoction over there, Azariah, you're noticing that we've been holding up the ice cream with some um, like holders and some poachers. So Azariah, what do you have here on display here for us this morning? Okay, so currently we recently got some merch for you guys. So merch. That you guys can take with you and Show it around, and right here we have a shop fan that we call it. Okay. And shop fan. Fan it. Oh. And you can fan yourself oh, if you like. Yes. And it, as you can see, it has our logo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 It's mm -hmm. beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you can take it with you yeah, to the beach, mm -hmm. and you can also use it as a frisbee if you'd like. It's fun for the children and the adults. Yeah. I like, that. I like that you open that up and then, okay, okay. Yeah. And then we and just, just put it back in the holder. Oh, it and zip it up. And zip it right yeah. no, no, zip. Zip. Oh. Yeah. Just put it in, it fits perfectly in there. And then you also have some holders. Yeah, this is mm -hmm. our koozies that we recently got as well. And it's great for the ice cream. It can fit both on the pints and the quarts. And you can put this here because we know that some of our customers, sometimes they travel far and they ask us to wrap it so that they can take it with them and it doesn't melt. And I, I think that this is a great holder for them to use because you know it helps them not getting their hands cold if you're dry. And you can also put this on your mug if it can fit. It's not only mm. limited to the pint itself and the quartz. And then I noticed that oh, there's some phrases on it as well. Like, where scoops uh, used to be. Yes, we all know the ice cream shop uh, used to be scoops. So, of course, I love that you remind the folks uh, here about yeah. that. Because they love the tradition, you understand? Like, I think every uh, time we come there, I remember sometimes I used to ask them to deliver food and, uh -huh. you know, I tell them um, at the ice cream shop. shop and then I'm like, and yep. then like, where? And then they'd be like, oh, you scoops. can just tell me scoops. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, so it's a good so, reminder. Yeah, Beautiful merch, some fans, some cups. Folders, lovely, right and there. And then you guys the have different types of cones, cup. right? Yes. Oh, yes, they also have cups for merch. Oh, nice. Yeah. 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 Look at that. They've brought all the merch. Oh. Lick this ice cream, please. You see that? You see that? They, they, yeah, they just do something over there. They, what, oh, really? Oh, yes. They were mixing up the concoctions in the ice cream shop cup. So, ladies, let's see what it looks like. So, what did you do here? So we mix, we blended the coconut latte with some coffee and it's like, it has a thick um, texture to it. So it's not as watery. It's wow, it's it's very um, like smoothie-like. Yes. Yeah. Sweet. 
me? Yes, so they're making yeah, mine so now. Yeah, so it's essentially how we make our milkshakes. Oh wow! Yeah, but instead of using milk, it's with coffee. coffee. Oh, we won't so get hyper over <laughs> here. Um, um, <laughs> Ready? Mm. Yeah. How is it? How is it? Mm. Okay. So, so <laughs> I'm assuming it's amazing. Brain freeze. No, oh. no, it's delicious. <laughs> but I got no one stop. <laughs> and so you said this is a mixture of the piña chelada no. and the. No, this is just the coconut, coconut latte, latte mm -hmm. and the coffee. Oh my yes. gosh, the wow. pina chelada must be delicious, delicious with this. Delicious indeed. Mm. Oh wow. For the pina chelada, we mix it with coconut water. Mm -hmm. And then for the tamarind chamoy, you get the pick either um, tam uh, watermelon juice or... Oh, oh nice. So specific flavors that to go along with this. Yeah. All right, nice. There's a combination between them. That sounds delicious. And now that I love has watermelon. Been, I, have, I can't wait to get <laughs> mine here. But yes, Azariah, you do have an assortment of cones here. I noticed some waffle. Some I waffle, think I see. Right? Yeah. So how? Um, what do the the ranges uh, uh, cost when we go to the ice cream shop? Okay. So we can start with the kitty cone. That's mm -hmm. a new addition that we have to. Or can I? Mm -hmm, sure. Kitty cone. Oh, they're so tiny. <laughs> <laughs> And so when we made this, we were initially, initially thinking about children, you know, sometimes their yeah. parents come and they want two scoops of ice cream and they're like, what? You can't eat all that in a waffle. Yeah. <laughs> so we made that and we we're thinking about them, but you know, the adults also like that in case, you know, they're on a, you know, they're on a diet or they want something different or a little, you know, they just had their dinner and they just want something a little yes. less. So that's also for them and that's for $5 for our mm. regular flavor. Mm -hmm. And then the regular waffle cone that we have, those are six dollars with a single scoop, and that has been around for a long time. Yes, and I guys love know. That. And it's, yes. a, it's a shop favorite. You know, every time people come in there on yeah, Sunday, they get really course. busy. Oh, can I get a waffle cone? Or sometimes they would tell us, everyone here wants a waffle cone. And we're like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember the last time I had a. Um, a regular cone. I know, it's very low. <laughs> Straight to the waffle. But, um, mm -hmm. oh, it's okay. ready. It's, I uh, need to immerse myself <laughs> in this and in okay. this uh, state that Duane is in, apparently. That's why I'm calling it a state. So, <laughs> ice cream? No, okay, okay. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> and these waffle cones that we have here, both the mini one and the larger one, those are made at the shop. They're made by us. Mm. Yeah. People make you want to a granny joke. <laughs> <laughs> why, why do people, why, why do you keep saying <laughs> <this>? <laughs> You know, it's so good. You're like, you know, you can slap a granny and it still work, you know? This is mm. fantastic. Oh my goodness. And if you're in the shop, you guys could also get another, like a scoop of ice cream on top of that also. Oh, oh, so oh. it's... Mm, add more to the Yeah, add more. Mm. Mm. Wow. <laughs> this, but guys, you have a surprise for us, yeah, right? Yes. Do. And the guys, <laughs> like, let's reveal that surprise, yay! Kay. So we have our Rainbow Magic flavor, and we brought it for you guys, and it's in... <gasps> oh, we're opening oh my it! Oh, guys! You know what? This is adding to our... We should have yeah. an Open Your Eyes gallery right. with the shoes and the hat, and now the ice cream. <laughs> I like that. No problem. And this is a rainbow flavor, do we? Yeah, rainbow magic. Rainbow yes. magic. Yeah, we magic. need to sample. We need to sample what this. What different types of ice cream are um, so well, they mine. Marshmallow and cherry ice cream. The color isn't specific to a flavor, so it's in like everything. Mm. <laughs> I can't double dip. Rainbow. <laughs> Magic in. Oh my gosh. Indeed, ladies. I'm getting enough just now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. Thank you so much, ladies. This is a lovely, lovely gift. One more time for our audience the new flavors. First for the summer. For the right? summer. We have pina chalada, tamarind chamoy, coconut latte, and green apple. And mm -hmm. then green apple, can't forget magic. <laughs> oh, and then, of course, your lovely blends of the coconut latte. Yeah. Coffee. Mm -hmm. And the other ones, Tambran Chamoy. And Pina Chalada. And Pina Chalada. The Sorbet Refreshers. The Sorbet Refreshers. Dwayne, we got to take a break. But you know what? We can we can sip and, and break at the same yeah, time. Yeah, we can. Of course, with, uh, with the lovely new merch of the fans yes. and their cups. And of course, their uh, holders. holders. Uh -huh. Ladies, thank you so much for coming in yeah. this thank morning. You thank you for us. helping us to start with morning, right? right? With the ice cream shop. Yep.
refreshers. Yes. Thank you so much. We're going to take the break, guys. But when we come back, we're going to continue this lovely trend of food and amazement with the BTB Music and Food Festival. Don't go away. We'll be right back. <laughs> 